The Venus of Urbino was painted by artist Titian. Titian is his English name. His full name in Italian is Tiziano Vercellio. He was born in Pieve de Cador, Italy, and is often nicknamed Da Cador because of that. He died in August 7, 1576 in Venice, Italy. Another nickname that became after his death was he was called the Prince of Painters. At age of 10, he moved to Venice to live with his uncle, and that's where he developed an interest in art and painting. He was very important in the Venetian school, and he was called the first painter by Emperor Charles V, who also gave him the rank of Count Palatin. His rival was Giorgione, whom he outlived, yet he still had close friends with other artists. His Venetian home was a gathering spot for such artists. Not much is known about his personality, but in comparison with Michelangelo, it is said that he is not as charismatic. He received lots of monetary support, for he had many commissions. He painted for Pope Paul III, which is the first image, King Philip II of Spain, the second image, and the Holy Roman Emperor Charles V, the third image. Some people say that King Philip II of Spain was his most important patron. The Venus of Urbino began the tradition of the reclining nude. The Venus of Urbino began the tradition of the reclining nude. In comparing some of more of Titian's artworks, we can compare it to the Assumption of the Virgin, which is the painting that brought him on the map. It was his work on his first major commission, and it was for a church called Santa Maria Gloriosa dei Frari in Venice. In both works, shadows are very similar and used his process of glazing to create the value. They both include a sense of depth, and they both include a separation between two seemingly unrelated scenes. Titian was a very influential painter. Because of his influence, it is said that he is known as part of a triumvirate in the art world with Leonardo da Vinci and Michelangelo. He influenced artists such as Rembrandt, Velasquez, Van Dyck, and Rubin. Those influenced him in their paintings can be seen beautifully painted fabrics and wonderful scenes with value. Titian was very influential on the use of oil paints in the Renaissance. Throughout his entire career, Titian stayed very versatile and he loved color, and that was passed on to those he influenced.